Hello everyone, my name is Mr. Brood and I'll be showing you how to downpatch Dark Souls 2 back to an earlier version of the game. We are specifically interested in version 1.02, calibration 1.05. As all any percent, all bosses, no DLC, and all achievements are all run on this specific version of the game. So, in order to do this, we have to go to speedsouls.com and go to Dark Souls 2. Now, go to Utilities and Resources and select Down Patching. Now, this page will entirely like show you how to do it, but I hope this video will make it a little bit more clear. First, be in the Steam client and be online. Then go to Run and fill in this specific line. Hit OK. And it should open the Steam console. Now, in order to download the, the patch, you have to insert a specific string that is provided on SpeedSource. Hit enter. And it should download the depot. Now, as you can see, there is no real indication of how far in the download actually is. So, other than going to downloads here and see that the network usage is actually uh, not zero, and there is some total being downloaded, there is no real indication of the progress of the download. However, the Steam client or the Steam console will actually tell you when the download is finished in such a manner. This will actually be like eight gigabytes, um, but in, for sake of demonstration, this will do. It will say down, depot download complete, and then it lists the specific file path where the depot was downloaded. So, as you've done that, you can go to your local drive or the place where Steam is installed, go to Steam apps and content. And this is where Dark Souls 2, um, the older version will be downloaded in. As it's currently downloading, this is obviously not completed yet, but it should be looking something like this. If you open the game folder, it's complete. And this is the older version of the game. And that's actually it. You have, just have to wait for the download to finish, and there you go. Um, you can actually run Dark Souls 2, um, the older version, right from this file, the executable. However, it's only not possible to do that if you use the Steam Big Picture uh, controller like, support thing. In that case, you actually have to copy the, this game folder and put it and override the one in your um, Dark Souls 2 directory. So that's actually it. Just go into Steam console, put in the string, voila. If there are any questions, um, you can always PM me on Discord or um, leave a comment down below. And I hope this will not uh, leave any complications. Thank you for watching.